Hi, my name is Jim Geezer. I'm the Study Abroad Advisor at Western, and I'm here to say I'm excited you're thinking about study abroad and I hope that you do it. I'm here to help make it happen and to tell you that it can happen, whether it's a two to three week faculty-led program in the summer, an entire summer, a whole semester, or an entire year. Um, my job is to help get a match for you, whether that's a location or a degree program that fits your major, uh, or maybe it's just liberal studies. We can find something that's a good fit for you. You can study in South America, North America, well, of course, that's Canada, right? Um, Africa, Europe, all across Asia, and all the way down to Australia and New Zealand on the other side of the world, should you want to. Studying abroad, I think, is an amazing experience. Uh, you have the opportunity to grow in ways that you wouldn't grow otherwise. You're stretched in ways that you would never be stretched if you just stayed here at Western. Uh, you leave what's known and what's familiar and you set into the unknown and the unfamiliar beginning with getting off that plane and that airport and half the signs aren't even in English and you got to navigate it. And that's just day one. Of course housing is a key question when it comes to studying abroad and there's a whole variety of options and depends in part on where you're headed. Uh, Latin America, South America, those destinations students typically stay with a family, it's called a homestay, and they become your adoptive family in the area, you eat your meals with them, and it really can enrich the experience. Many other locations, it'll either be an apartment, uh, single rooms with a common living area and a shared kitchen, or a dorm. Uh, many parts of the world, students do a lot more of their own cooking, and instead of going to a large uh, dining facility, so you would hopefully become a good cook by the time you're finished with studying abroad. So uh, let's get you out of here, right? A few, a few ideas. You can go here, here, go here, 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 here. But you know what? Europe. Let's get further away. Over here, up here, down here, and all the way down here, of course. I think that's about a 12 and a half hour. Some of the time zones in Australia really are in the half hour. You'd be amazed. Or stick with Africa. Not quite so far, but certainly a different experience. South Africa, Ghana, um, Botswana, and let's go south. South America, Brazil, uh, Peru, Argentina, Mexico, Costa Rica, and several others. Or just go north. So next steps, uh, start with our website, studyabroad.wcu.edu, or you can go to our uh, Facebook page, which is uh, Study Abroad Catamounts, just search for that. Or come visit. Um, Study Abroad office is within the International Programs and Services office, which is in the Cordelia Camp Building, or room 109. Look forward to seeing you.